Welcome to Tea Time on Plus TV Africa, where we discuss the biggest entertainment stories. My name is Elsie Godwin, and I'm here with Ewa Obitu and Ife Oluwa Oshunkeye. It's good, yo. Just there. Just there, too. Now, wow. That was hyper. She didn't want to go down. Yes, then. You just switch. Yes, now, yes, now. You know we're on the same vibe, we're on the same wave, you know what I mean? Now, wow. You know, Shadow, we are the ginger. We are the boom. Your glasses is falling. I need spiritual wife fat. Let's do boo 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 boo. Bamboo. Okay. Ah, so what do you do boo? No, no. you're your own. Only you will do you. that. <laughs> anyway, um, my business. right. Moving on to the main story. Michael Collins, Ajere, Ajere, or Ajere. Anyway, we know him as Don Jazzy. He's questioning government policy on taxation. He tweeted, and I quote, how does the government plan to bring many Nigerians out of poverty when the struggling masses, neck deep in poverty, are being overtaxed? The income and living standards of citizens of other countries that pay more taxes cannot be compared to that of Nigerians, um, end of quote. According to the Central Bank of Nigeria, the new policy stipulates stamp duties payments on individual transactions that occur on POS rather than previous plans where charges occurred on aggregate transaction. So for me, and what I understand from what is there are plenty tax English, mm. is um, they are now going to be charged on each transaction done mm. on the POS. And the only thing I can do is, as a good citizen of Nigeria, and as someone who cares about her neighbors, I will switch back to um, carrying cash uh, up and down. I pay them in cash. Because I don't know why you people are saying. Stop using I don't know why you people are saying we are you moving to cashless. Just, no, no, we we'll just go to the bank. They, you, they, they, charge they say they want to move to cashless now. society, and you are making <laughs> it. Very soon, they will so start charging for no. entering the banking. No, 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 that one is The banking hall owner, I think, is when you deposit um, from 500. No, but I'm just joking. Like, no, they say take your money where you deposit 500,000. No, no, I'm not going to withdraw. Draw now. Do they charge? Ah, we draw. I think so. Because ATM, no, but you will charge be. me. POS, you want to charge I me? I think now. Then I will just be entering back. I'll be doing a draw. I think if you if you are withdrawing like over five hundred thousand or so, they mm. will charge you. Yeah, mm -hmm. definitely. And if you're That's, paying into, they will charge they'll you. They will charge you. So let's switch to a job. I want to start a job. Even the people that handle the job. No, no, me. I'm starting. No, ch no charges. Dear just, management, just... please start paying me in, ca in cash. <laughs> like I'm just trying to let you know that I'd rather do cash than going through all this. But, but let's I... face it, though, the the taxation in this country or, or the tax policy is really outrageous. Mm. I've seen a lot of um, nine to five workers that complain about what they get charged as tax mm. for. Um, on their salary and most times these companies do not even tell you that oh we're going to be taking x amounts from your salary you just realize that when you get your first salary they take out a very outrageous amount and you're like <coughs> where did that come from you get what i mean and then mm. you go to your hr they tell you oh this this, this. it doesn't happen to me personally so <laughs> yeah, yeah. Past I was <laughs> Experience. No, but I have a friend that was so bitter. He came back mm. from and I asked him, How much? No, you know, I said 30,000. Ah, ah. His money must be high now. You should tell us how much is there. Nah. <laughs> yes, you guys no. balling. Oh, like, ah, so now 30,000 on me. He said, No, that you don't understand. Is it just for the tax, or, uh, tax and um, tax. what is it called? Just, um, um, pension. pension. Just his tax minus pension. Ah, he has the money now. Nah. Oh, no, 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 has no. He has a very, very, very solid standard job. Uh, okay, so why is he angry? Why is he angry? That's my pain exactly like. <laughs> Yeah, they are thinking you that you are collecting thirty thousand in a one week. Okay, you know, said no. If he calculates that thirty thousand in a year, he knows how much it is. It is. Yeah. So it's not about that much. Mm. I mean, it's he will be very angry because a lot of things that the reason why he's paying the tax in court is mm. not benefiting from it. Mm -hmm. Do you get? If you're paying tax and you're seeing all these things, what is what Don If you can saying. walk into an hospital and there's free health, health care and you know that you're getting proper free health care, okay, you know that my my tax there is, is working. Power in the road. There, you can, um, there's no traffic, you can move from your house from this time, you don't have to buy extra yeah, food. Fast, you know, and then, Lord, <laughs> you, when we fall, you cannot move. You know the, you know you the annoying buy. thing when it comes to road, mm. even when they try to give you one kilometer of good roads, mm. they still want to tax you on that road, you right. pay two gates. I'm like, then what are you using these taxes to do? I, I don't understand. I don't know. Like I Even the flooding you are talking very, about. Very high person in the society in Nigeria that entered um, Saturday's flood. And all these electricals are off. His AC is off. <laughs> everything is off. You understand? <laughs> A very high place person in society. It's very mad at the government. Hmm. Do you understand? No. It, you, if it's high place, it's just like, you should talk to them. <laughs> 
imagine me, me ordinary me now. Nah, my car is sounding some it's time, grrr, doing some grrr, type grrr, of way. You know now, nah. and I'm yeah. like, what's going on here? If I feel your pain, you feel what I mean. So let's even start by. Yeah, and I think the people Don Jazzy, I think the people that. he's targeting with this tweet has to be those that would always come out to defend the government and tell you, have you gone to UK? Do you know how much they pay as tax? Mm. And the question he's asking them now is the kind of um, amenities these people they enjoy. enjoy. Mm. I mean, if they I pay if them hardship allowance, remember? <laughs> <laughs> You know, so I'm glad that someone if like they can be getting a cheap allowance and mm. then me that I'm so suffering allowance. the real hardship, mm. God, God, no, me, I, I still have to pay tax. I mm. mean, not just pay tax, huge amount. Hardship allowance. You know, because after the hardship, I still suffer on top. Oh, I'm so telling you, <laughs> no, but that Saturday rain was something else. And it I, was I, really I, something I read else. that. I don't um, know if you guys saw one thing on one of those popular blog sites that yeah. somebody was swimming and they said, Yeah, I saw yeah. training, yeah. training I mean, for the 2020 It was really close Olympics. to my area, the person was swimming. Mm. You saw the person, no, but like, the but was he really training for the 20 or is just one of those? Just I was just concerts. having fun, but <laughs> funny, dirty water. I don't know, I don't but really good. Like, I couldn't even step out into that water, but you went to look for food now. I didn't step. I and now the car is Now you have to pay it's mechanically. Less, less. That is the sad <laughs> thing. Now, I want to buy ordinary food. And then I'm going to have to pay mechanic for to come and check this one. I don't understand this sound. Just because I'm going out. How crazy is that? No, to and be then on, you tax I, I, me. To be honest, my point is, if we're paying this tax mm. here and we're seeing what we're paying for, for. Mm. I don't think people will complain. Mm. It's because why not get... In fact, we're getting minus everything we're supposed to get. Yeah, and I think get, people this tax will affect more. I mean, yeah, this particular tax is talking about has mm. to be the small business owners because they're the mm, ones using POS. And imagine taking out that amount on every transaction. Like, how much are they gaining to start with? Because they, they go through a lot to even set up the business and some of them are running on loans and you want to keep extracting this amount of money from that, which is what I'm saying. Because I love my neighbor as myself, I will try. Although I've gotten used to um, being cashless, like most times you really not find cash mm. with me. But now I will deliberately be going to enjoy this. Do you know that me? I even cash. thought I'd become wise. I don't even use ATM again. As I'm buying for, please give me cash back. Do you understand? <laughs> so I'm buying for you, give me cash because oh, I know they, they don't would, charge yeah. me for POS, but now if I use the ATM, well, now you start collecting money from me, collecting from them. Mm. Do you understand? And I think, so like, Elsie, going to be wise? Elsie, like you said, most people will have to resort to carrying cash around, and that will increase um, crime rates again. Mm. Because now, um, I mean, it seems to not be aware that people have cash ah, at home. No, with forget them that everywhere. one. If they want to catch you, they will catch you. Now, they carry POS around, too. Uh -huh. Okay, this let's move on. Yeah, I beg. Um, Adele's Twenty One has been named Britain's Britain, Britain's best-selling album of the twenty-first <laughs> century. The album contains great hits like "Rolling in the Deep," "Someone Like You," and um, "Set Fire to the Rain." The twenty eleven album earned Adele a record time since Grammys. It saw the most physical sales digital downloads and streams of any record in the UK since the turn of the century. The list was unveiled to mark National Album Day on August, um, October 12th. I have a problem, Martin. <laughs> and then oh, it's no. also <laughs> important to mention that um, Ed Sheeran, um, he got the fourth and fifth place with his albums Multiply and, and Divide. Divide. So yeah. I think that's a good one. But mm. um, this focus is on Adele, but I just thought it was important to mention. I mean, if you're having two spots, no, on the same two, right? I mean, no, she has one and two or one and three. Who's that? Adele. Adele. Just one. Just and one. the big, uh, just number one. So who's two? That's um, uh, Amy Winehouse. No, no not Amy. Amy. There's Winehouse. a name I saw, Can something, not Amy. So Amy is the third spot, right? Yeah, I think so, yeah. Okay, so because I, I guess that's where I mm -hmm. got it mixed up. So she took number one with mm -hmm. two albums. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's amazing. Because I was thinking she took number one, two, mm -hmm. then Amy took number three, then um, what's it called? Um, What's his Ed? name? Ed took um, number four. four. Then this guy took six, um, James Blunt and the rest. So this is just amazing. I think um, I like the fact that they focused on um, the British albums because mm -hmm. a lot of people do not actually listen to their kind of music apart from very mature people that like good music, actually. Mm. So, but uh, people making this list are people you would say they are mainstream, actually. Yeah, they are mm. mainstream, but mm. how many people... Well, don't let yeah. me don't let me speak like that though, Maybe because I know a lot of I know a lot of people mm -hmm. that will not sit down to listen to Adele for a minute. Ah, ah. 
No, 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 I see it's okay I'm because there are some people mm -hmm. around you, yeah. people you know. Mm -hmm. I mean, there are thousands of people mm -hmm. out there that are listening to her, like yeah, every yeah, day. Yeah, yeah. You're, you're a hopeless romantic. So <laughs> <laughs> I can understand your own case, so it's fine. But do you know how many thousands of millions of hopeless romantic people we have out there? Mm. So. Apart from people in my squad, shout out to the Misty squad. Back to the matter of the day. <laughs> <laughs> I love Adele, don't get it wrong. Mm. I have 21, I have 25. Does she have 27? Uh -uh. I'm waiting. So be <laughs> I said I'm waiting. So I love 21, I love 25. I, I have um, all our singles. I listen to her uh, at least when I want to go to bed. Or, you know, when what you have... You mean? I wish nothing or when you have perfect the company. best for you. <laughs> you know? She's singing that for you. I wish nothing but the Don't best Don't forget me. I will. <sighs> I will remember you, you say. Sometimes you... You love her. You know It's you time for her. a quick break. But while we're well, talking, I hope you're singing it right. It's an awesome They're watching on bed television. <laughs> Welcome to Tea Time on Plus TV Africa, where we bring you the biggest entertainment stories and, of course, analyze them for you. You can have both parents and still end up as a useless child. I they see them every day. <laughs> <laughs> Most times, I worry more about where I'm coming from mm -hmm. and where I am now, wow. and that determines my next step. Why are you sounding like an Alibaba? Alibaba. <laughs> <laughs> Plus TV Africa, we're feeling good. No time to do Everybody feeling all right. Minimal mm. Akpala music is for mature minded people. I got DM sometimes from Malawi, like, woo! Sleeping early, sleeping early. Welcome back. Kanye West confirms he has converted to Christian. I think he's saying he converted this year. If I please, you are the one that's always deep, and Ewa is the deeper, deeper. <laughs> that is, he, uh, he's always seeing what we are not okay. seeing. So over to you too. Let's, um, let's let's start by saying that uh, Kanye West started this religion a while back, so it's safe to call him um, an atheist because let's say he doesn't believe in God. That's why you. Oh, okay. Want to so start this year, religion. he started believing in God. Yeah. So mm. if you created your own religion called Jesus, you were even going to start a church, and uh, people you, you you started having followers. You started calling. In fact, your clothing line you still have. I think I have some Jesus outfits as well. And then we still have, huh? Okay. Original. I never wear fake, darling. Okay. Mm. Which is not original or nothing. Back to the matter. Bone of contention. If I must look for the opportunity to display himself. Mm. Is it not original or nothing? No, I just wear a tagless yeah, shirt. You, you I, I wear a name. I, I wear what, a shirt what name without a name. This? What name is this? Mm. You probably have to check. I think it's Kenneth Cole if you checked up. Okay. Huh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> go on, go on, go on. <laughs> so, um, so, um, you lost your three. Please, let's just Back to the matter. Uh -huh. So, Kanye West started his own religion, and he's somebody that um, believed it was a god or mm. a, a, a demigod, and suddenly he started the Sunday service. And then you remember when I was telling you that, oh, it's um, circular music they play on the circle mm -hmm. uh, on the Sunday service. Then I came back on the same set to correct myself to say, oh no, they tried to make it that even if it's a circular song, mm -hmm. they take out all the curse words, mm -hmm. they take out all the dirty parts and replace them with um, conscious lyrics and all of that. So that was a step further. And especially the fact that it's a Sunday. Now he's dropping his first album, Jesus is King, which I'm definitely looking forward his to. His first album. Yeah, I mean, his first gospel album, yeah. So he's still his first album. <laughs> Anyways, because it's his first gospel album. I say born so, again, as a born again, because yeah, he's yeah, now yeah. Yo, that is that so, become new. He's dropping his first gospel album, Jesus is King. I'm looking forward to that because I want to hear um the message in that, and then he featured a lot of people. I think I've heard one song from the album already. No, sorry, I've not heard one song. I saw the track list of the album. <laughs> I was wondering. <laughs> I saw the track list of the album when it came out, and um, I'm actually looking forward to it because I saw the people he featured on that album and. Yeah, so big shout out to Kanye West. He should have, I think it was long overdue, especially with the um, old phase he faced at some points in his life when he was in the sunken room and all of that. It's only right that anybody gets closer to God after all of that. Mm. 
Okay, I, I don't know. <laughs> to be honest, when I saw that he's saying he got converted this year, I think maybe with Ife's explanation now, I understand mm -hmm. better that he's moving from Jesus to Jesus. Mm. Mm. Get. But, <clears throat> yes, now he's born again Christian, and I'm happy for him. His pastor, um, Tyson, was saying in one podca podcast I was listening to that he's so devoted that even if you're saying a curse word near Kanye, he will tell you, don't say that around me. I'm now a new born again Christian. That's just mm. hypocrisy. How, how, how does he cope with his uh, in-laws? Hypocrisy. <laughs> well, That's hypocrisy, if you ask me. If, if it's about curse words, if it's about all of that. Being born again doesn't change who you are. It doesn't change what no, you... It no, does no, 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 no. It, it who changes you are. who you are, <laughs> mm -hmm. but you can't use it to affect other people around you. You it, can. It, Huh? Yeah, that's evangelism. That's evangelism. Okay, that's what he's doing. Yeah. It's just if like... he's trying to win souls for Christ, it's mm. different. But don't tell me if I say Kanye and I'm like, oh, Kanye, <laughs> oh, Kanye. Oh. He'll walk away. He'll walk away. Eh? Yeah, he will. Eh? Come on, I saw oh, is your, Are you sure? Have you forgotten who he is? Is Kanye? Are you sure? You keep sure? you say, no, I'll never cuss again. I'll never cuss again. I will <laughs> And I like that um, he has accepted Jesus Christ mm. and he's preaching the gospel. He's mm. not being selfish about it. Um, where, he, where he was on Sunday, the union he was, he said he's not yet to perform. He's yet to preach the gospel. And it's a good thing. I'm happy for he's him. He's actually winning souls to Christ. Mm. Big shout out to Kanye West. He's always Kukabo, an inspiration. From one business to another. Tonight, but I mean, a lot of people. Church business. No, imagine Kanye West joke. now goes to um to be a pastor. Mm. He goes to school. He becomes a pastor. He starts a church. Mm. Do you know how many people will be trooping into that church? See that uh, Calab Calabasas um um, um what's it called? What what type of houses do they call them? The ones they tore down. Oh, the houses he was um, mm. trying to build, okay. You see, they'll give him the land. It will be because the people that will be trooping into the church on a Sunday, they don't even want them in that neighborhood. Mm. So they will say you people should take an entire town for yourselves because mm. Kanye West will pull the crowd and he will actually win souls for Christ. I mean, so when I read, God chooses I read, to um, choose the right people, mm. I think he knows the right people to and choose. And Kanye West, God yeah. has chosen him now. Possibly. Okay, now. Yeah, I don't know about now. But I read, possibly. I read um, a lot of things and people think that this is is all is still about Kanye and not about God. Mm. He's just trying to, you know, manipulate people and get them at the end of the day, these people will start worshipping him mm. and not God. That's what some people think, you know. I mean, people already worship yeah. the pastor, so do you, do you get think too Kanye far. is just like people I'm already saying, worship celebrities, if, not even pastors. Yeah, so, so. if um, if he's now a celebrity and then a pastor the pa I mean, <laughs> and then he has that kind of space, I mean this is Titan mm. offerings we're talking about, fam. But moving on real quick, mm. OAP no, Dutton business. says he got a death threat for accepting to interview Tasha. So um, he really went on some serious rant on social media. Mm. And um, before you guys say what you think, because I, I'm, I think I'm blank on this one. Okay. I have, however, reached out to T-Bills for Tasha to be on the show. So hopefully they respond soon so that we can get the death threats also. Mm. Who is it? Ah, <laughs> oh, I said, oh, I said. Mm. <laughs> I don't want death threats. <laughs> <laughs> so you don't want to sing that song? Uh, don't let Tasha fans, Titans, don't let them come. Ah, I want to sing on this night. But anyway, that's but you what know I'm that song, done, right? so... Mm, you know that song? Right? Stay but we on the song. Stay on the song. Stay on See what I'm saying about all place romantics right now. But when we're talking about Tasha now, nah, and you don't want to but sing that song. But what do you think about this? Well, I think um, it's actually crazy to, um, the extent at which some fans take this thing. So it's not that deep, actually. See, some people are just doing their jobs. OAP Dotun did not invite Stacha. Mm. Eh? He said T-Bills. I like the fact he even dropped disclaimer. <laughs> That's no go. But he was he reached out to him and he said yes. Yeah. So I mean, Probably he me said find yes. Them, oh, nah, because of They're fine, you and you agree. No, but to and be honest, that. my problem is... Mm -hmm. Other housemates that have been out of Big Brother, mm. yeah. They went for media rounds? Yeah, they went for media rounds. Mm -hmm. And there's not like a particular publicity. Let's say somebody's coming in today. There's like a proper. Well, they, they, it's not like they, they didn't have like a proper management. It's just a case of you came out of the house and um, I think Big Brother organizes mm. the media rounds. No, no, rounds I for think you some of them. Start going some, for it. some of them have like proper management, actually. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I know about Islam yeah. more for sure. So, some of them, before they even came out of the house, they mm -hmm. have like proper management already. Okay. Yeah. So I don't know why there's so much announcement. And I don't know why Dotun did this, to be honest. Please I'm, don't, don't shake me before my time. Because if, if uh, Tasha is coming to this show, I will do flyer. 
So please don't shed no, no, me no, before no, no. my it's time. Okay. <laughs> it's okay for you to do fly. Okay. I'm just saying that he has probably had like other housemates here mm -hmm. on his show, and mm -hmm. there's no like special. But, um, well, it's possible that the flyer no, is not from Dotu. It's probably a TBS manager. Do you know why? There's no flyer. It was Dotu's tweet. Let me tell you why. There's a flyer on TBS page. Yeah, and let me tell you why this is a big deal actually. Mm -hmm. Because um, he was tagged on Twitter. Yeah, Tatcha got disqualified. Mm -hmm. She did okay. not leave the house. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, Tatcha she did not. Um, she said she wasn't going for any meeting. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, she said she wasn't going for any Now, she did not. She said she wasn't going for any media round. The other people that came out of the house. Went, went for media rounds. She not said or she no, wasn't she, entitled she wasn't, to media no, rounds. No, no, she was yeah. uh, no, I think that, she wasn't entitled to media rounds. Do you know how many people that have called her for interviews? And this was a, going to be her first radio interview, mm -hmm. and it was supposed to be granted by Dotun. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? So mm -hmm. that's why it was such a big deal. I like, think the, the problem, the, problem, problem the reason why Dotun got this um, death threat is because when Tasha was in the house, mm -hmm. he said, um, like some, not, I don't want to call it negative comments mm -hmm. because it's just saying what it is. Do you mm -hmm. understand? But it was not in support. It was not supporting her when it was um, when she was in the house. So they now I think yeah, mm -hmm. I think that's the problem now. They are feeling okay, like. Did anybody say that fans are the ones threatening? I'm right not now, saying though. that our fans are the ones threatening. Dotsun. Are you saying the people that like Dotsun? I mean that the people that like Tatcha are the ones threatening? Nope, I don't know them. I'm not saying the okay, plan. Okay, so I think, I'm just saying. I don't know. Did anybody well, see the threat? We're thinking a lot to do. Mm -hmm. Did anybody see the threats, like the tweet or the message? Or mm -hmm. did you say it? Did, did you see it? Didn't post it. it. Didn't post it. So ha why? What if this is another publicity, publicity stunt for us yeah. to talk yeah. about Tatcha? Because, because that was what I, I was don't know. Say that. All these people's death threats. What mean they come out death threats? What did they threat to you with? Did you see the and then, don't sorry, what did you know? Do was here the other day, and she said she was just joking about the whole death threat. And look at how seriously we took mm -hmm. it. Like, so, so sometimes it's just publicity. This one, I mean, and now you need to come and show me the message so I can identify the threat in it. Oh my! He will grant the interview. He wants to. He is likely. No, the interview was supposed to be today, so they shut down. No Wednesday. It's not today. Mm -mm. Oh, okay. Doctor will grant that interview. No, it's supposed to be today. Monday horses is on Monday. Nope. Yes, it's called it's Monday when? horses. Okay, let's hold on for. It's called Monday horses. But um, okay. I think that show comes up every day. I think I don't know, yes. but. I think it's Wednesday. Well, okay. that's how we wrap up on this episode of Tea Time. Thank you for watching. And remember, you can always watch this episode and all our exclusive content by subscribing to our YouTube channel, Aplus TV Africa. Okay, I'm getting information that it's Wednesday, so let's just say Wednesday. <laughs> Sorry, people. <laughs> Wednesday. Yeah. Where did I get you from? From your heart. <laughs> you can also watch Tea Time in London on Ben Television. My thank you as always go to my co anchor Ewa Ritu, and the troublesome one, if you're Lua and the boy. entire production team. <laughs> My job. name is Elsie Godwin saying thank you for watching and have yourselves a good day. <laughs>